Renee Moran with the University of Maine Cooperative Extension and the Highmore Farm Egg Experiment Station. Today I'd like to talk about when is the best time to pick apples in Maine. Pe some people prefer apples to be firm, crisp, and uh, very tart. If you like your apples on the uh, green side, is which how, is how I refer to it, it's best to pick them early in the ripening window. One of the best ways to determine when to pick an apple is based on how you like them. I like apples on the ripe side, so I like to leave them on the tree a little bit longer than most other people, unless I want to store them a long time. So for a variety like ginger gold, um, or any variety, the best way is to simply taste it, to bite into it. These are fairly sweet because we left them on the tree a week longer than normal. And then another way, without having to eat the apples, to look at the, the green skin color. When it turns from a dark green to a light green, the apple is starting to ripen. And they, they're, they'll continue to ripen once you pick them. Another uh, criteria that people like to consider in determining when to pick is the degree of red color on the apple. This is not really a true indicator of the ripeness of the apple, but because as temperatures cool off in the fall, apples will develop more red color as they get closer to harvest. But in a year like we've had uh, this, this summer, very hot temperatures have kept a lot of the apples from coloring up, and most of them have, uh, have very poor red color, even though they're almost ready to pick. Honeycrisp is another uh, new variety to Maine. It also comes from the University of Minnesota. These two varieties were bred for winter hardiness, so they can be grown as far north as Aroostook County. But they're popular all over the state. And they're ideally suited to the climate here in Maine because of the cool fall temperatures. In other parts of the country where it's very hot during apple season, they don't color up as nice, and they don't develop the same flavor or good storability. We do a lot of variety testing here at the Highmore Farm, and we currently have about 80 varieties of apples. Um, some are no longer being evaluated, but most I still look at almost every year. The best way to keep apples in good condition once you pick them is to put them in refrigeration. It's nice to see a bowl of apples sitting out on a, in, on, on a table as a nice display, but these apples will not keep as long as apples that are in cold storage. Here at Highmore Farm, where we expect our apples to keep in good condition until January or May, we store them at temperatures as close to 32 degrees as possible. But in your refrigerator, where it's 40 degrees, this should keep apples in good condition for up to a month.